Take a quick look at one of Kotoko's former players who is charting his own course in the United States. And Elvis Amo looks to have a comfortable spot in the United Soccer League. That's America's second tier league. Yes, after leaving Asante Kotoko. The man told me he wants to take his career to the next level from here. Elvis Amo's time at Kumasi Asante Kotoko was brief. He wasn't there for too long before he moved on. But well before he did... He had played and made a good impact in Kotoko's iconic red jersey. Kumasi Asante Kotoko was a good experience. I would say it was a big learning process for me because that was my first time, you know, testing the Premier League. So that's what I would say. It was a big learning process for me. It was a team in my heart already. So playing for them was a big, you know, achievement for me. After the Kotoko exit, Amu moved on to the West African Football Academy where he played for a season before he moved on to Czech Republic. There, he made a handful of appearances for SK Listen in the country's Premier League. All those, he says, have been a good learning curve for him. It has really, you know, changed me in a lot of ways. It's helped my technique. It's helped everything, everything that I, um, I learned here. It's just polished it because of the facilities and the good things that they have, the training regime and everything. So I would say it's made me a better player now. Now, Amu plays in the United Soccer League, America's second tier league, where he features for London FC regularly. He made 24 appearances and scored 9 goals last season. After a good season, Amu says he is looking ahead. You want to be on top, you know, and for me, I think that I'm at a level where I think I'm ready for any market. I want to move up to the best of the leagues, whether it be in Europe, United States or whatever it is. It is every, you know, player's dream to, to represent, you know, their national team. And um, for me, I mean, I've not had a chance to, you know, play in any of the levels, but I'm still, you know, keeping my fingers crossed and just working hard. I believe that hard work will take you anywhere. So I'll just work hard as I can, you know, to get that, you know, attention from the national team coaches and then the officials, to, you know, to give me a chance to, you know, future for the Black Stars. Well, that's obviously a move there.